Hi, I'm Paul Wilson, creator of The Body Swing and the director of the Paul Wilson Golf School at Bears Best Las Vegas. Here's a great hip drill to help you learn how to use your body to hit the ball instead of your arms. If you like this tip, make sure you give me a thumbs up, then click on the red button to subscribe to my channel, click on the bell so you're notified when I post new tips, and please tell all your friends about my tips. You know, there's a lot of other people out there that need help too. In this tip, I'm giving you an amazing drill, okay? This is the huge, huge, huge difference between pros and amateurs. This is it. This is the difference. You get this, no joke. Your whole game will go to a whole new level, okay? This is the one right here, okay? I've kind of talked about it in some other tips. I'm talking about it again, because this is so unbelievably important you got to get this. This takes coordination. It takes a little understanding. Coordination. How do you get coordinated with something? You keep repeating it until you get the coordination with it. This is vital. Okay, so what is it? It's separation. You're separating your upper from your lower. Pros do this. Amateurs don't. What am I getting at? If I'm here like this and I try to whack at that ball with my arms, I just basically face the ball as I hit the ball. So I'm up here, whack. Your setup looks just like impact. Your hips have not rotated by the time you hit that ball. Okay, so what do we gotta do? We gotta get our hips moving first. We gotta turn our hips more. So we're up here like this, right here, we are going to start using our legs and hips right here. By the time pros hit the ball, we are rotated anywhere, let's say 25, 30, upwards of 45, Dustin Johnson, 60 degrees when we hit the ball. Okay, that means we started here facing the ball. We hit the ball here, rotated. So how did our hips get ahead of the ball at impact if we started facing the ball? Well, your hips must be moving ahead of the golf club. Because if it all moved at the same time, you'd be facing the ball when you hit the ball. Okay, so we got to get our hips moving first in the downswing. And this is where everybody goes wrong. So you're looking at an object. You hit the top of your backswing right here might be in a half decent looking position. It looks pretty good. Right here though, you got the wrong thought. Human nature is telling you to hit that object right there. So what do you do? You whack at it with your arms. Your arms move faster than your body in life. So you're moving your fast arms ahead of your slow body. So when you do that, you just face the ball when you hit the ball. So now you're not in a position that a pro would be in. So we need a different thought, okay? So we're gonna hit the top like this. Instead of thinking here, we're gonna hit, we're gonna think about our belt buckle, okay? We're gonna turn, or let's say our hips. We're gonna turn our hips first before our arms. Your arms aren't gonna stay up there forever. They're gonna follow. Okay, so hips first, club follows. So, like I said, this takes coordination. If you haven't done this before, you're not coordinated getting your body to move first. So if I've got a drill that gets you to get this, then I would be doing this constantly. I'm telling you, you get this piece, no joke. <laughs> Irons 10 to 30 yards longer easily, driver, I'm going to say 30 to 50 yards longer, easily, okay? That would be a huge payoff for a little bit of work, okay? You got to do this daily until you get coordinated with it, okay? So here's what I'm doing. I'm here like this, facing the ball. I take the club back right here. I'm going to take my hips or belt buckle, let's say. I'm going to feel like it's pointing at the camera. Then my club hits the ball. It's too much. 
it's a feeling. Okay? So you're here thinking about the camera, okay? Or your target. At home, you got a tree there. At the golf course, you got a, I don't know, a mountain in the distance. You got the clubhouse over there. Something. Think of that thing that is right here. You're here like this. Just hold, I would hold the club up in the air like this. Okay, so I'm already thinking here. I hit the top. See my hips got to the camera, then the club came through. Didn't look like this. All together, together, see, together. My hips are just facing the ball. I need your hips facing this way as you hit the ball. Okay, so think of the thing over here. Okay, here I am. Hips, then the club. Hips, then the club. Feels like your hips are already through and you haven't even hit the ball yet. Every pro in the world does this. Okay, it varies a little bit. Like I said, Dustin Johnson's like 60 degrees. I don't even know how he does that. Learned as a kid, okay? But every pro has their hips open when they are hitting that golf ball. So you need to get that move. I am telling you, this is it. This is the huge move that you are not doing, yet every pro is doing this. So this will take your game to a whole new level. But as I said, you will not get this in two seconds, okay? You got to get coordinated with it. So I get people doing this and I have done this for since 1991 with people. And yeah, when they first start, they're like falling all over the place. Okay. But as they keep doing it, they separate the upper from the lower. That's why it's called separation. Start getting that and no joke. The distance just increases like you wouldn't believe. So let's put some for, put forth some effort, okay? You gotta do this daily. Too many people, you know, practice literally maybe once a week, okay? That is not enough for this. You have to do this every day. Take a golf club, have it sitting at home somewhere, give me 25, okay? If you want it faster, give me 50, give me 100, give me 500 a day. What, is this gonna take you what, a week? a week to learn a move that every pro does. And you're currently not doing this. And if you don't believe me, just video your swing. I guarantee at impact, you will look like you're facing the ball as you hit the ball. You will not look like this when you hit the ball. I guarantee it, okay? So that's a huge move that would take a little bit of effort to dramatically change your game. So if somebody told me that, I would be all over this. I would literally be doing a thousand of those a day until I had it mastered because I would want that move. So it takes repetition, it takes coordination. Start repeating it, then let me know <laughs> how you are doing. I am telling you, below this tip, we will have comment after comment after comment of people that did this that are hitting unbelievable shots versus what they were doing before. Okay, so let's give it a try. I truly hope you've enjoyed this tip. You know, I've been teaching a powerful, effortless, pain-free golf swing now since 1991. If you'd like to learn this type of swing, then head on over to bodyswing.com slash free samples, click the link up here or in the description below, and I'll send you some free samples of my body swing book and video series that take you step by step by step through how to build a powerful, effortless, pain-free golf swing. So once again, head on over to bodyswing.com slash free samples, click the link up here or in the description below, and I'll send you the free samples right away.